Hello everyone. Have you heard of Google is removing GP console accounts without terminating or violating any policies? Yes, you have heard it right. Google is removing many of the GP console accounts without violating any policies from last few months. The reason behind termination of this GP console accounts are really interesting to know for you. So you must have to know this reason behind the termination without any policy violations. To deep down into the this secret reason, interesting reason, I have divided this whole video into the four main parts. You can see a four major part of this video into the screen. The first part is all about introduction. The second part is all about reason, the secret reason behind the termination of GP console accounts. Third reason is a process. And the fourth is what if your account is removed due to this reason. So this is going to be a very, very interesting video of all of my previous termination videos. Stay tuned and let's go ahead with the first part. So let's get to the first part of this video. If you just meet me, this is Nilmi Wada, founder and CEO of Coolmind Techno Lab, a premium mobile app development agency focusing on collaborating with the clients by taking their complete responsibility. Coolmind will be your responsible technology partner for all your digital needs. Feel free to reach out to us on the link given in the description and contact us for any kind of mobile app development requirements. We are happy to help you and collaborate with you. Let's get to the second part of this video. Reason behind removal of the accounts without any policy violations. This is the real villain of this video. I would not say the villain, but it's a core reason, the core concept of this video behind the termination without any policy violations. It's an interesting one. We have recently found from a few of our previous clients that their accounts are getting removed from the Play Stores and that is even without any violating policy. The reason behind removal of this GP console accounts is due to pending verification process. The real core reason behind this removal is nothing but just a simple verification process you have to conclude, you have to attend in the Google Play Console account. This verification process has been initiated by Google on July 23. Google has given an ample amount of time to all the Google Play Console owners from July 23. They have given us the time till August 23 and there was another two options. If you don't get a chance to complete your verification before August 24, you can extend your verification process up to September or October 24 based upon your account. So from July 23 to August 24, they have given an ample amount of time to all of the Google Play Console owners to complete this verification process. So I'm making this video to provide you an alert if you have not got a chance to log in your GP console accounts from a long back or if your apps are getting removed then this might be the reason you have to log in into the GP console account so you can check this you can start this verification process and you have to follow the simple steps so let's get to the third and the most crucial part of this video what is the solution and or I would say what is the process to get verify my profile as a GP console owner if you have created your account before September 2023 listen me carefully as a GP console owner if you have created your own GP console account before September 2023 then you must have to pass on with this verification processes this verification process aims to prevent the malware increase the trust and 
decrease the frauds from the Google Play Console owners. If you have been heard of, there are a lot of spammy or buggy applications being uploaded by many of the app owners from last few of the years. To prevent them and to, you know, secure their users, this verification process is getting introduced on July 23. Google has given a few options to do this verification process. The first option was you can submit your documents for being verification and being verified by the Google team. And the second option is if you cannot do that, you can also extend your deadline. So primary deadline was before August 24. You had to submit that. If you are not able to do that, there was an option. You can extend your this verification process up to September 24 or for a few of the accounts, there is a process to be done before October 24. It depends on the various parameters. So what is the verification process? Let's get to that point. Now let's get started with the process. I will not, process is very simple. I'm not going to go deep into this. What you have to do, you have to log in into your GP console account. Once you log in, you can see on my screen with the different kind of screenshots I'm going to play. You will able to see this kind of messages. And besides of this, you will be able to see the view details option. On clicking of that, you will able to have an option to upload your documents. Once you go for uploading your documents for starting your verification process, there are two kind of documents which you have to submit. You can also see these kind of things on in our video screen. So the first thing which is about verifying your identity. Make sure before verifying your identity, make sure that whatever the payment profile you have created in your GB console account, the same name should be as a verification submit documents you have to submit. So for example, if your profile name or your payment profile name is Alex Johnson, then you must have to submit the document with the same name as an Alex Johnson. For identity verification, currently there are four different options and it may be varies. It may be, it may be different, different based on the country. So the four major documents are driving license, passport, PAN card and voter ID card. After submission of the verification identity card, you will have to submit documents for identifying the address. Make sure that identity verification documents will be uploaded with the both side images. Whether it, it doesn't matter if the another side is not having any important details, but you have to send both sides image for the identity verification. For the address verification, you must have to also one more time take care that the name with the profile name or the payment profile name should be match. So after submitting the documents, you will able to see the message that we are reviewing your data. We are reviewing your details. And after reviewing your details, once the verification process is complete, that alert box, which you have been seen in the previous timeline of this video will be removed and your TV console account will be secured once again. So hope you like this video and the reason behind the GP console termination without any violations. There is still a most important point which is still pending which I cannot cover in this video but I will make sure that I will cover that in our next video. The point is what if your account is getting removed and what to do to create a new app after removal of your account because of pending verification process. So if your account gets terminated with the reason of pending verification, there is a high chance you can upload a same application with the same name, with the same logo 
in the new GP console account but that process I will share with you not in this video in the next video meanwhile stay tuned with the channel stay tuned with us like and share this video if you really like it comment below for any kind of your queries you can reach out to us on the whatsapp number given in the description and you can also book and schedule your paid consultation program for any kind of consultations you are required from last more than one year i am conducting those kind of sessions for many of the clients who are stuck with the google play console accounts there are a lot of clients who are facing repetitive termination of their gp console accounts so i'm here to help you if you are facing the same kind of terminations on repetitive gp console accounts feel free to reach out to me we will work together and we will find solution for your termination till that time subscribe the channel and like and share my videos thank you